Tired of shooting visual effects, covering all the angles and shots, FPV cinematic shots, nerfs, sounds like too much of a hectic job, right? Don't worry, I'm here to help you out to reduce all these professional tasks to just a few clicks. Let's jump back to the studio to see how it works. Transition. Yes, that's something I would like to start with today's video. I've got you one of the best platforms available in the market for you to get photoreal 3D captures. So let's get started. I'll just open up Luma app on my iPhone real quick. So I've created this amazing transition from the Luma app. As of now, this app is only available for iOS devices. So in order to proceed further, you need to install the app from the App Store. Once you have done that, click on Add New and start capturing. Basically, you have to place your subject inside the cube shown on the screen and then capture it in three layers. So scanning is done and you are good to go. Now you can use the scanned object as a 3D model. You can either export it in these 3D file types, which would be more useful for us, or you can also create basic shots like panning and orbiting and export that as a video file. So let's hop onto the other side of the video where I'll be talking about the usefulness of this tool and also sharing my opinions. Starting with the advantages. Being an architect, having 3D walkthroughs of our projects and providing that to our client is a joke and we professionals end up either spending too much time to do it ourselves or paying thousands to freelancers. Or imagine you are a visual artist struggling with nerve or photo scanning or even a game developer struggling with game assets who end up paying a large sum of money for quality assets to the stores. Now all these things could be done with few clicks and now you know how. Luma also comes with cross-platform support which means you can also use it with other platforms like Gen 1 by Runway ML. Wait, wait a second. If we are talking about cross-platform support, how can we forget that Luma has now released its plugin for Unreal Engine and also it got you covered with features like color grading or nerf. So now you can create, shoot and animate on your own. You can be Harry Potter of your Hogwarts like the Bad Decision Studio or you can be the giants of the city like the Corridor crew. Like who cares, you have this powerful tool in the palm of your hand and you have this creative freedom, also inspiration from these amazing artists. Moving on with the advantages, Luma has simplified skinning technology and drone nerfing. Also photo scanning doesn't work well with shiny objects or reflective objects, you might know, but nerf from Luma AI captures everything seamlessly. By using this, it makes it easier for visual artists and cinematographers to create scenes in which characters are freezed and camera is moving through the scene. Proceeding further, let's talk about some of the cons of this platform. The only con I have encountered personally while using this platform is the fact that some amount of geometry of the objects is somewhat lost and the fact that Luma AI is still not available on Android devices. Coming to the end, I would like to mention there may be some flaws in this platform, but this tool is proving to be a valuable asset for the professionals and with further development, it could be difficult to identify the difference between a nerf and an actual video. As for my research and knowledge, booming AI industry is a boon for working professionals, including architects, cinematographers, game developers, visual artists in this case. Anyways, what do you consider AI to be for you? Please do let me know in the comments below. That's it for today. Hope you guys found this video helpful. Now, if you are looking for a powerful AI tool that will tremendously improve your writing with AI, do check out this video from here and you can watch my recent video from here. Yeah, like, share, subscribe, stay safe. Bye-bye.